Hello and welcome. Thank you for taking a pause and stopping by today. You made the right choice. This is the reporter for WTVK9. Positively, your best source to follow Team USA during the 2018 Winter Olympics in Pyeongchang, South Korea. Yesterday, the 23rd Olympic Winter Games officially began with the parade of athletes and the lighting of the Olympic cauldron by South Korea's own Yuna Kim. Mixed doubles curling continued with session five of round-robin play, where United States lost to China 6-4. to four. In session six, the Hamiltons defeated Norway 10-3. to three. Men's snowboard slope style kicked off, with Redmond Gerard being the only USA competitor to advance to the finals. For cross-country skiing, Jessica Diggins finished fourth in the ladies' 7.5km plus 7.5km skiathlon. Caitlin Patterson, 34th, followed by Keegan Randall and Rosie Brennan finishing 40th and 58th respectively. In ladies' biathlon, Germany took gold in the 7.5km sprint, where Team USA didn't break the top 50. In short track speed skating, the men took on the 1500 meter. J.R. Selsky and John Henry Kruger were penaltied out in their semifinal skates, while Aaron Tran made it to the finals and finished fifth for the USA. The ladies ran their heats for the 500 meter, where Mame Biney was the only representative for Team USA to make it to the semifinals. Carlin Schutens competed in the ladies' 3000 meter in long track speed skating, finishing 22nd. In men's singles luge, Chris Medzer for USA sits in fourth after two runs, followed by Tucker West, 18th, and Taylor Morris, 23rd. Germany and Norway took the podium in men's normal hill ski jump, with Kevin Bickner finishing 18th. Events continue this evening with Session 7 of Round Robin Play in Mixed Doubles Curling. USA will take on Finland at 7.05 with hopes of a win to keep their Olympic dreams alive. The Shibutanis look to boost USA ahead in the figure skating team event as they skate their ice dance short dance at 8 p.m. Eastern, followed by Brady Tunnell performing the ladies' single short for Team USA at 9.45. The pairs free skate program will begin at 11.40 p.m. Eastern. Gerard Redmond will be competing in the men's slope style finals at 8 p.m. Eastern, followed by ladies slope style beginning their qualification runs at 11.30. Four USA men look to reach the podium in men's downhill skiing starting at 9 p.m. As for action after midnight, men's cross-country skiing 15km plus 15km skiathlon begins at 1.15 a.m. with four athletes representing Team USA. Emery Lehman competes in the men's 5,000 meter long track speed skate at 2 a.m. USA's women's hockey plays Finland at 2.40 a.m., while the men's singles takes runs 3 and 4 beginning at 6 a.m. for Luge. Tess Johnson takes her second qualification run at 5.30 a.m. with hopes to make it to the finals at 7 a.m. The men's 10 km sprint in biathlon kicks off at 6.15 a.m., and then the action will be paused until 7 p.m. Eastern. It's going to be another exciting night of Olympic events in Pyeongchang, South Korea. You can catch the action on NBC. Hey you, I'm the reporter for WTVK9. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and we'll talk to you tomorrow. So long!